In this video, I'm going to demonstrate a little bit of ant behavior and also test an ant hotshot gel to see how well ants really like it. So I had an outbreak here on this table of ants that I just noticed this morning, and I thought this would be an ideal place to put out the ant bait as a test. So this is a time-lapse photography, and as you can see in the beginning of the video, we're not getting much action. And so um, I'm going to put this near a trail that I, and try to get them to take the bait a little bit quicker. So have you ever noticed that you never see any dead ants laying around? And the reason is that the sister ants remove any dead ants, and I'm going to show you that right now. So I'm going to pause the video right now and show you something. Notice that this ant apparently has had too much poison and has died. And so what's going to happen is that another worker is going to remove the ant. So here she comes. And there she takes her off. So in this next test, I went out of the backyard where I've got just thousands of ants in a really good trail. And I'm going to put a little bit of hot shot on this concrete to see how it works. All right, so let's go ahead and start the time lapse photography and see what happens. So as you can see, they start to find it pretty quickly and they spend a good deal of time sapping up the poison. So, so just as a test, I went ahead and put on the wrong type of bait for this ant. So I've got sugar ants and this Armador uh, Max Shield is really not intended for them. I, but I wanted to see whether they would take it anyway. And as you can see, they really have no interest in it at all. But note that in the background you can see the liquid bait and as it starts to dry out they spend less and less time on it. So it appears that the liquid baits work best when they're wet. So if you like this video please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for the latest updates.